you're, you're training academy. You've got this new link up in in Hereford, I think it is, in Ludlow. Tell us a bit about that. Well, I think when uh, I was chairman manager at Hereford, uh, the financial position of the club was a bit precarious. Um, we didn't uh, couldn't afford a youth uh, program. So we linked up with uh, a college just outside Home Lacey, uh, um, Hereford, Home Lacey College, Agricultural College, and they wanted to get into the football. Uh, Gary Stevens, a former player here, who I mm. signed from Cardiff, I think, uh, some years ago, and a chap called Andy Williams uh, started up in a football academy there, and uh, we linked up. They played uh, in the Football League Alliance on a Saturday morning, and FA Youth Cups under the name of Hereford United. And it actually produced one or two players that we signed. Mm. One player in particular, uh, Andy Williams, who we know from his performances for Swindon against us, turned into a very good player. And the club sold him for a fairly substantial amount of money to, to Bristol Rovers. And uh, after I left Hereford, they decided to, to go down a different avenue. So the college linked up with Cheltenham. Cheltenham have subsequently gone with a big big college in Gloucestershire so they were left with uh, nothing to offer the kids other than uh, the opportunity to go in there. Linking up with the league club allows them to go back into almost the Premier College League with teams that are connected to Chelsea, Fulham, Tottenham. I think they did take a team last season when they were in it down to Chelsea's training ground to play so it's good experience for, for, for the lads in there. We're quite pleased with the way it's going with our youth policy. Um, we've got the four lads in the side at the moment, another three uh, on the fringe of things. And so it's just another recruitment area. If we think the lads are good enough with, uh, with the colleges, they'll come in full-time with us. 